Hello, my name is Eric, and I want to talk about the black and white bar in Warframe. The first time we made this alignment, as they call it at the Phantom, or I will call it the black and white bar, is in the War Within quest. There is no any in game data to tell us about what the black and white bar is or what it will do. Is it gonna affect your gameplay? And what is the black? and the white represent. Well, I will show you all the options of black white bar first, then we will talk about what this thing is later. The first time we meet this black white bar is in the World Rifting quest. When we face those men on the ship, we have three options. I can hear them. The grown-ups are howling at the door. Drowning mad in the void ocean, but you, you are at ease swimming within the depths. You remember then how the howling stopped. They had broken through. I held out hope we'd be rescued. So I avoided the bloodshed. They had lost their minds. I didn't blame them. We built a makeshift prison. They were nothing but animals by then. So I hunted. So I hunted. When we face the continuity, we use our void power to reject it, and we also have some thoughts about it. The endless void, the gazing abyss, the bottomless ocean of horror. It coiled itself around your tender heart. I hated it. I embraced it. Then we choose one way to kill the queen. For Dax! A chance to kill you. And now, I finally have it. Shall I, Tenno? No. Let her rot. That will be her sentence. <laughs> no, I will do it. Kill her. No. No. At the end of the quest, we choose a way to deal with the Kuva. You don't know what to do with it. Tell me. Mm. Some believe the Kuva within is the blood of Orokin ancestors, an elixir of power, of immortality. Others believe it to be a poison, a corrupting oil that brings madness and evil. What do you believe? I believe them both. But for you, Tenno, perhaps this Kuva is just a symbol that what you choose to do will define you more than anything.
You mad at me, kiddo? Did you forget? You owe me. You owe me. The world weighs more heavily on you now. Try not to lose yourself, Denno. The next time we meet Black White Bar is this in is the Glass Game Bit Quest. So clean. Everyone is nice to me, so I guess I'll get used to it. I'm so weak from the treatment, but I feel stronger every day. I don't know what I'm going to do now. I guess anything I want. I miss my papa and my family, but I sure don't miss the mumblers. Thank you, Tino. I've returned to my people, but I've decided I will be the last Triuna. I want a future where all of the children can be happy. A new tradition. Papa is so proud of me. The last Triuna and greatest of all. The one that changed my Conians forever. I know our ways might seem strange to outsiders, but there are ways. I would never choose to be anything but Myconian. To be their Triuna for as long as I can. Thank you, Tenno, for keeping my family safe when I couldn't. The next black white bar is at the Sacrifice Crest, which is one way to take care of Umbra's memory. We had created monsters we couldn't control. We drugged them tortured them, eviscerated them. We brutalized their minds, but it did not work. Until they came. But it was not their force of will. Not their void devilry. Not their alien darkness. It was something else. It was that somehow, from within the derelict horror, they had learned a way to see inside an ugly, broken thing. And take away its pain. We use this memory. It fuels our breath. Take away its pain. We accept this memory and move beyond its reach. Take away its pain. We return this memory to the void and find peace in our emptiness. And we have some words to Bellus. You think you can defy me? Not even your Tenno devil can... <gasps> I created you. You are. I. I am just a stone. She is the hand.
This was inevitable. Yes. <laughs> yes. She has foreseen it. The cycle is broken. Now I know what she sees in you. Where is she? Where is the Lotus? At the new war crest, we convert the kids in the shelter. Down. Why is this happening to us? What did we do wrong? Something went wrong with the jump. But we'll survive. Promise. Okay. What did we do wrong? Just try to keep quiet. And uh, don't let him fall asleep, okay? Okay. I don't know. But we're going to figure it out together. Okay. Okay. Hey, why don't you go sit closer to the others until we get environmental back? My mom's coming to get me soon. Oh, please, would you snap out of it? We are on our own now. No! My mom's coming! Coming to get me soon. No, she's not. We're going to be your family for a while, okay? No! My mom's coming! I know, but go on. Just for now. No! My mom's coming! And we choose one identity to define Lotus. I... I'm not sure. There are voices. I am not one. I know. But... Maybe you could choose one voice to lead the others? It's your choice. The times ahead will need decisiveness, power. I shall be Nata. I see violence and suffering in our future. We will need compassion and strength in equal measure. I am the Lotus. Narmer has divided the world, leaving a deep wound. We need healing. I am Margulis. Okay, so that's all the options of the black and white bar. But not only the black and white bar itself, you may think that the options itself is difficult to understand. So I choose some options to explain how this thing goes on. The first option is talking about what happened to the Oracle military warships, their Maintain Zero. Because of the ship malfunction, the jump become catastrophe. The ship is flooded by the void power, and as we know, that the normal person cannot stand this power. So those men become insane and start to kill each other. And the Tenno saw her mother smashed by those madmen, so the kids retreat to the classroom and make shelter. But the shelter will eventually collapse, 
so what we do next is a key to affect the black white bar. The white Tenno choose to avoid fight because she thinks that they will be rescued by the Oricon, and those being mad can be cured. The neutral Tenno have nothing to think about those men because what else can be happen to those men that is insane? The black Tenno rage of her mother's death and thought they were just monsters so she hunted, or be correctly, she killed all of them. At the sacrifice class, we choose a way to wipe away Umbra's pain. Emptiness is more likely forgot about it. I think why this effect of black white bar is Oricon use helmet robbers to make warframes. They have proper armor to block damage, and they have power ability to win the fight. But no matter what they do, they just can't be controlled. Maybe the virus itself makes those warframes got mad. Just imagine one day you become those killing machine and cannot be normal person anymore. I think everyone who became this thing will eventually become mad. Until they use transference. Bells told Han Hao that Tenno have the ability to see inside an ugly broken thing and take away its pain. So those Tenno use their ability to comfort those warframes and they eventually can be controlled. Just like the same thing we did to Umbra. The difference is the mad from normal warframe is maybe come from the virus and the Umbra's comes from an unforgettable memory. Father! At the end of Sacrifice Crest, the Black Tenno said, The cycle is broken. But what is the cycle? I have no true answer but a theory that is about the Oricon society. The Oricon always invent something to use or dig up some resources when they are needed, and when they are not, they destroy it, just like Umbra and Nata. I make mistakes, like you. <laughs> They do everything as the same, like all oh, the solar system, like Earth, the homeland of humankind, like the sentients sent to the Tao, and like the Warframes, those help them win the old war. So when the creation killed the creator, the cycle is broken. And why Tenno said this maybe just answer better this words. I created you. So that's how I explain those options, and let's discuss what is black and white represent. I've asked about my audience at YouTube. Most of them think they are motionful and motionless. Others think they are pure and evil, the reality and the void, and the truth and the fake. I personally think that definitely not the pure and the evil, because you can't just tell what is pure and what is evil about these options. And I think the key is what Bellas told. We have a ability to take away one's pain. As you can see, all the options is affected by our minds. And I think what we thought about the void power is far more interesting. We can hate, we can accept, and we can embrace. Because someone in this world hate the void power so much that she cannot become a Tenno. That is Drifter. Drifter reject the void power because she may think she didn't need this thing. And also she is the one who waiting for rescue. But we know she is not to be rescued and drifted at the world of delivery. But even if we hate, we can't be drifter because we are the one who accept the void power, even if you hate it so much. But maybe you can accept those power, but your mind is closer to Drifter. So if you accept this theory that the white might be represent the Drifter, then what will represent the black one? I think for many people the answer will be pretty obvious the man in the wall. The black option is to embrace the void power, and maybe the man in the wall, or I will call it the void spirit, is the one Tenno, but fall far more deeper to the void power. So the void spirit gained more void power, and she embraced it. And we may have no idea why they do these choices, but maybe I know what the black Tenno will do the choice, that is, embrace the past. As you can see, the black Tenno is always do the things that is already happening. If someone killed her mom, then she killed them. The Oricon commands the Dax to kill someone, 
and she also commanded the Dex to kill someone. The Oracle used the Kuva, so she used it the Kuva. The Triuna was at the Mykona, so she will be at the Mykona for sure. The Warframes didn't have a memories, so Umbra shouldn't have either. When the cycle is broken, she shows a little sadness about it. When the kids needs their parents, she told them all the things will be fine, just like nothing happened. When the Lotus need to choose one identity, she chose the one who shapes her original Margulis. All the choice that Black Tunnel made is just like she is the one who embraced the past. And this make me remind that the last episode we talk about the man in the wall, I have mentioned that the one who killed Era is the man in the wall. And when we break the obstacles of our memory, we gain the void power. And the man in the wall always said we own her, that power belongs to her. So if the man in the wall equals the past, equals the void power, then the black one represents the void spirit may be an acceptable theory. On the contrary, I think the neutral channel just like machine, they are motionless. All the things they do is just let things happen. They choose to not have any thoughts, about the madman, they give the Kuva away so they won't need to choose. When the Warframe has a memory, well, so be it. When the thing is inevitable, that is inevitable. When you were the Lotus, well, you are the Lotus. I think that is what Tenno now looks like. Just let all the things happen because what else I can do? And what about the white one? What is the theory about the white? Well, Leave a comments down below and so we can discuss about it. At the end of the video, I want to talk about the black-white bar about the lotus. The white represents Nata, the neutral represents Lotus, and the black represents Margulis. That is the most confused option I have ever seen because that is what the Lotus should choose, but we choose it anyway. I think that because it affects the game mechanism, so that it's better leave a choice to the players. But why these choices? can affect the black white bar. Is this our own or the lotus black white bar? Or the lotus choice affects our black white bar? When we choose Nata, she will say Nata represents decisive and power. When we choose Lotus, she will say Lotus represents compassion and strength. When we choose Margulis, she will say Margulis represents healing. So can that be Nata equals decisive and power equals white? Lotus equals compassion and strength equals neutral, and Margulis equals healing equals black. I think that is really hard to say because many black options is about to heal, but they are drinking Kuva and kill also in the black options. So leave a comment down below and let me know what you think. We'll see you next time.